Hi there, students. Familiarity breeds contempt. This is a common adage or proverb. Let's see, this says the better you know somebody, the less respect you have for that person. Or you can also use this phrase in a situation that in a situation that you know very well you can become careless. If you repeat something, you do something that, that you know very well, you can become careless while doing it. So familiarity, to be, be familiar with something, to know it well, breeds creates, causes to happen, usually something bad, to breed, to reproduce. So familiarity um, causes and then contempt. Contempt is a strong feeling of dislike, to have no respect for someone or something. So um, he uh, f uh, treated me with contempt, yeah, he treated me very badly and in, in an un unpleasant way. Okay, so familiarity breeds contempt. If you know someone very well, then um, it, it doesn't lead to a, a good relationship. Yeah, um, if you know, you stop respecting people when you start to know their faults. Um, I think generally um, you are uh, find more interesting, more en enigmatic people that uh, you don't know. But as you become more aware of their faults, then you become more scornful. Yeah, so. Um, Let's see, uh, what does it say? Some, so, yeah, fish and house guests stink after three days. Yeah, so it's nice to have a, fri uh, a friend to come and stay, but if they stay too long, familiarity breeds contempt. Yeah, or I think this is also very similar to this um, proverb from, I think, probably from the, the Bible, a prophet has no honour in his own country. Yeah, so um, somebody that you, you know very well, you find very di very difficult to um, see their good qualities. But notice, you can also use this for a situation or for an action, something that you do the whole time. It can result in you doing it carelessly. Um, for example, I know the statistic that says that most car accidents occur within a couple of miles of your house. And that's probably because you know that area of road really well and you, you are not as careful as you would be in an, a, on a piece of road that you don't know so well. Yeah, so this, this um, familiarity breeds contempt. If you know somebody very well, then you stop respecting them. Yeah, um, I think maybe this often happens in relationships. Um, that uh, you, you fall in love with someone and then over time you get to know each other better and better. And then finally, familiarity breeds contempt. I don't think it's ne necessar necessarily true, but it can, um, it certainly can well happen. Um, yeah, I, I guess the idea is that you can uh, see their bad uh, qualities uh, more and more and you find it harder and harder to see the good qualities in them. Yeah, so familiarity breeds contempt. Um, as to formality, I'm going to give it a six in formality. Use it absolutely anywhere. Okay, so, well, I, I, it's probably a thing in life. I think too much exposure to something means that you uh, don't like it or that you, you're not impressed by it. Um, if you live in a place that has beautiful scenery, you don't appreciate it as much as if you go uh, a thousand miles to this place on holiday that has equally beautiful scenery. It's because familiarity breeds contempt. 
or maybe there are some wonderful quality local products but well you don't think they're very good because you've seen them all your life but if somebody looks at them from the outside they look absolutely fantastic so enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon bye for now familiarity breeds contempt